camera still on. <laughs> Hello everybody. Oh, I can see lots of people. Look at them. They've got them dog collars on. Hello everyone. I'm Dave the Dragon. Uh, maybe you don't know me. I'm actually quite famous on YouTube. Uh, Dave, 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 what are you doing? Uh, I won't tell her. Uh, Dave, this is the Dyson Conference. Come on. I'm supposed to be looking professional. Professional? Yeah, I'm, I need to tell them about what I'm up to. Sorry, everybody. I'm just going to make Dave leave. Dave, can you go so I can film on camera? Oh, all right. YouTube, don't forget. Dave, go. Bye. Right, bye. Sorry. <laughs> Dave the Dragon. Maybe you haven't met him. He's on our YouTube channel, Impact242 in Cross Hands. And I'll introduce who I am. I'm Esther Lockley. I'm the lead evangelist at the Centre of Mission in Cross Hands. Really good to be here today and tell you a bit more about our vision and our heart for the Centre of Mission. Um, so yeah, check out our next bit, The Vision. Hi everyone, Esther here again to talk about the vision of this centre. So this is the Centre of Mission. Uh, have a quick look around, you might have just seen our uniform there um, on the side, which is where we can give a uniform to families that need it. The, ce the centre is about being a place where people are welcomed, where they are loved and not judged. It's going to be a place of um, love, of Jesus, um, and we can't sh wait to share that with others in this community. Um, this is also going to be a space where we're hoping to be running a cafe and a soft play for the local community to come in and have a couple with us, um, especially focusing on children, kids and youth um, who uh, perhaps at the moment aren't entering our churches so much, um, but this will hopefully be a space where they can come and be part of a new worshipping community. So we're really excited about what this centre is going to be um, and what amazing things God's going to do with it. So the next bit we're going to show you is just some of the things we're doing at the moment as we wait to be able to put some of our vision into place. Okay, let me show you around. What am I doing, do you ask? <laughs> that is a very good question, very relevant. So what we're doing here is we have a food bank, we're running a food bank delivering parcels to families um, around Cross Hands. And who am I, did you say? I think I heard you say that. I um, am the pioneer evangelist, I'm the worship lead. Uh, started on Monday, this is my, my, my fifth day. Um, and it's going well, it's, it's, it's exciting. God is moving in power, um, and yeah. How better to finish than by sharing with you a story of how God is already moving. So last week um, we uh, went round a guy's house who for the first time needed a food parcel um, and we met him at his door um, and what he was sharing with us is, you know, he, uh, the, there, was down, there was serious damp, the walls were like crumbling, yeah. um, he'd been living without a cooker yeah. for the last few months. It was having a huge um, impact on his mental health and well-being. Yeah, um, yeah. And what we really defined was that, so he'd been... So he'd been living in this house for 10 years, unemployed for four or five years. And he said that really what, what he needed is to move to Llanethly mm. um, so that he could work there. Mm. And so that's what we prayed for. Um, yeah. And, and the he texted day, me, yeah, he texted me, he said, you never guess what. And I was like, what? He said, um, I've been offered a flat in Llanethly. The answer to prayer was just immediate. It was amazing. Uh, loads of emojis of, he, of him. He couldn't believe it either. It was incredible how God had moved in power. Mm. We'd love it if you would follow us, if you'd like to contact us, and if you'd like to visit us, you'd be so welcome. Take care. Bye.